Original Bob went on CNBC oh, back in June. And let me play for you what he had to say about ABC and Legacy Network. I mean, he has a very different attitude than the Fox executives because he knows he needs to cut his cords, right? The, the ABC and even ESPN and that traditional broadcast network, it's done. It's totally done. So what he wants to do is shift more and more into streaming. I mean, it's not so easy because people keep dropping their Disney subscriptions, and we've seen that reflected in all of their numbers. But he wants to kind of synthesize and focus on what he needs to focus on, which is really not good news for the ladies at The View, right? This one in particular. Oh, there is breaking news. Uh, we just uh, learned that you know who has received a letter from special counsel Jack Smith notifying him that he's a target <clears throat> in the DOJ's grand jury probe of efforts to overturn the 2020 election. Lawmakers are reacting. Let's see the clip. <laughs> Former President Trump has done... Okay, so she's just a little too excited, right? Well, anyway, that excitement is going to be short-lived because, I don't know, I mean, maybe she's got a 10-year contract and whoever buys ABC is going to be on the hook for this one. But what's going to happen is it's going to be sold to another player, maybe Nexstar. We got word today that Nexstar and Disney have been in discussions. There are some estimates maybe the company would be worth about $4 billion. It produces the view, of course. So if Nexstar buys it, what they're going to do is they're going to look at it and they're going to say, we're going to ride this until we can't anymore. Cable's still a profitable business, super profitable. As long as you don't have big name talent like Whoopi or Joy getting paid so much, right? So you're going to just have to slim the place down and rethink how you're running it. Bob Iger knows this. It's why he wants to get rid of these businesses. Watch, here he is in June on CNBC with David Faber talking about how he's going to change. Transformative work is dealing with businesses that are no growth businesses and what to do about them, and particularly the linear business, which we are expansive in our thinking about, and we're going to look expansively about opportunities there because clearly it's a business that is going to continue to struggle. Well, let's stop there for a second then and just and let me ask you about it. Um, we're talking, I guess, ABC, the network, the, the stations, but then the cable networks as well. Yes, correct. FX, uh, Nat Geo. Is it possible you would look to sell them? We're going to be expensive. I think if you can, you can interpret what that word means. You know. No. Well, I told you back then. We knew what it. We knew then what it meant. It meant we're going to be expensive. We're going to sell them. Okay. So he wants to sell. He wants to divest ABC, which produces and owns the View. So all those big salaries for the likes of Whoopi and Joy, bye-bye, bye-bye. Again, Next Art Communications, this has been leaked, Bloomberg first reporting this, that they were in talks, uh, they've been ongoing for Disney. There will probably be some other suitors out there. I wouldn't, ex I wouldn't be surprised to see some private equity, forgive me, actually, uh, some, um, yes, some private equity. I mean, you, you might actually see some PE players in this space because they'll say, wait a second, we can take this, we can slim it down, we can run it really efficiently, we can get rid of all these big, expensive people and create a new kind of business that will last for a while. It'll last until it doesn't last, kind of like Fox News, which again is why, like, I just say things are changing really rapidly and very quickly. And from my perspective, I would just say this, it would be really nice if we could have more players, right? And maybe it doesn't have to be in cable, it's here, right? You're all here, thank you for being here again. But you can be here, I think we need more diversity of opinion because right now there is an effort underway to really just squash one entire side and that would be probably the side you're on if you're watching my show.